been an excellent result away at one of the league's informed teams at the minute. Yeah, good result, good performance. I thought a tour goal was absolutely outstanding. Obviously, the way the game started, we were in control. And the ref gave a penalty. He's been kidded, the referee. The lads bought the penalty. Addy hasn't touched them. And, um, you know, it's, it's, it's just it's a dive. It's as simple as that. It's disgusting from the lad buying the penalty. But it is what it is, and the character we showed to come back from that, um, the instructions the, lad took on board, the lads took on board at half time. We wanted to get Freeman in the pocket more, get him on the ball, and he started to hurt him second half, really started to hurt him. So, um, great performance from the lads. Over the last few weeks, we've been talking about being clinical in front of goal today. Four different goal scorers and four goals for the team. You must be impressed with that. Yeah, delighted with it. Yeah, yeah. Look, uh, well, the most thing that pleased me, the first two goals, are looking down the barrel of the goal. Obviously, they come and try pressure. That's how they play. We were sort of bit playing Matador, really. We wanted to move them around. I mean, knew the centre halves is jump air midfielders at 10. So um, I really like the way they play, to be fair. They're very aggressive. They're on the front foot. Um, they've been in fantastic form, so full credit to the manager on what, on what they're doing here. They've, they've got themselves off the foot of the table, and uh, it was a difficult game for us today. But I thought our players, like I say, stuck to the, the tactics, stuck to the instructions. And uh, once we got them in a half time, we could really start to hold them and penetrate. We did that, so really good performance. And it was great character from the team as well. So to go 1 0 down with that penalty early on, to then go 2 1 up, then can see the goal pretty much straight afterwards and then to win the game 4-2. Yeah, that's what spoils the fun. When we're 2-1 up and we're in control, we give away a really poor goal from a corner. Uh, we don't squeeze the ball well enough. Uh, they get a 2v1 against us. Obviously, one of the lads hasn't done their job. Um, everyone's man for man in there. So, just really frustrating with that. But the character we showed, the togetherness we showed, like I say, to stick to the game plan, penetrate the tactics, what we asked at half-time, showed them on the video at half-time, which is very important. And uh, like I say, once we got free in them in that hole and hurting them more and more, and I thought Pritch was an absolute star while today. He cleared one off the line, he made blocks, he scored. Um, real captain's performance from him today, so special mention to him. Uh, another special mention to Gatlin, two games, two goals. He's really settling into the side. Yeah, we just got to get him match fit, we've got to get him sharp. Um, great finish, to be fair to Brunty for first two goals he set up both, didn't he? Two fantastic passes. Um, but his fourth four goal was a clinical finish, really good. He had a great chance second half as well here, where I think one of their lads made a block when it looked like it was going to go in. So um, we just got to keep walking. We're, we're trying to teach him the game, we're trying to teach him how to play properly, play up front, we want to see numbers, um, a bit like we did with Nicky. Um, but the lad's got power and pace, he's got unbelievable natural ability. And he's receptive to coaching, because uh, when, I've, when I've been walking with him this week, we did some video with him to help on his game. You could see he's brought it out Saturday today. So um, I'm really impressed with what he's done so far for us. You saw just touch on there, Zach Brunt's performance today, two assists, another great performance last week as well from him, he's doing really well at the moment. Yeah, that's 19 goal involvements for the kid. He's a good player, look, he's young, so with, with youngness you sort of get, you get that sort of rawness a little bit, a little naive in his game at times, but today, you know, I asked him how many tackles could he made, I thought he made loads of tackles for us today. I thought him and Harrigan were outstanding in the midfield, they were in the midfield. And uh, obviously the icing on the cake is the two assists for Brunty. He had a chance here on the, sort of on the edge of the box, which you expect him to score. Like I say, Jim, if you want anyone on the end of a chance, it's always Brunty. He's got that much ability, so he's doing great for us at the minute. Um, one name missing from the team sheet today was Nicky Caban, but he was involved on the bench last week. Uh, is it just his injury playing? Yeah, his injury's come back again, so he's got a slight hamstring, so we'll see how he is for Tuesday. We're hoping he'll be back for Tuesday night. Um, obviously, injury concerns hard for us at the minute. No car now. We haven't got a captain Gorman. Uh, we still haven't got um, Hooper still out. Uh, who else? Collins. We've got a long injury list. So for us to be continue to win football matches is uh, is very positive. It shows the strength and depth of the squad. We also saw Ade come off today after going down. Have you managed to speak to him after the game and yeah, what he's happened? Just to had him? a bang on his knee, so we just took no risks and just got him out. It's just a clash of knees, so uh, he should be okay. It's just it's just an impact injury. And now two days before travelling again to Aldershot. How are these next couple of days going to look for you in the yeah, group? Yeah, obviously long. You get back, recover, professional. Um, I don't know how old the shot are on today, but I did watch all the shot for the other day. That was a really good game. I thought it was actually a good game of football. Um, they're dangerous, so Tommy's team, you know, the lad up front, Tola, it's, just, it's a good player. They've got Stokes, they've got so many good players. So, so we just got to be at it. We've set the standards for ourselves. When we know we, when we're at it. Um, we're a good side, so it won't be easy. It's a Tuesday night and it's uh, away from home, so another difficult game on the road. But we're looking forward to it. And then finally, our fans make the long trip up today and uh, given a great game to watch today. What's your message to them? Yeah, thanks for the support. They're delighted for them. You know, you know, they go home now and they can enjoy their evening, enjoy their Sunday and uh, get behind us again away at all the shots. So 
another big game for us. We're, we're ticking fast now. We're Saturday, Tuesday. This is the real business end. We're coming into the home stretch now. So um, I want to thank them for travelling. I know it's difficult uh, to get up here, but you know, appreciate their support. Dean, thank you for your time. Cheers.